Welcome back, everybody, to Pop Culture Conspiracy. I'm your host, T. How are we all doing today? And in this video, I'm going to be talking about Blue Ivy starring in Mufasa, The Lion King. I believe this movie is going to be a sequel to The Lion King that Beyonce was in a few years ago. I believe that movie came out, don't get me wrong, maybe 2022? Yikes. Can't recall. But I believe this film is going to be a sequel to that. And Blue Ivy is going to be starring in it as the voice of... Um, the daughter of her mom, Beyonce Nala. And Beyonce is going to come back too in this film to voice Nala like she did in the first. So before I hop in, please like, share, and subscribe. Let's talk in the comments. You guys, your fave, your fave is a show mom, just like her mom. And her father, like, you know, Blue Ivy's father is a show dad, just like Beyonce's dad. Just cycles repeating themselves. I think it's nice that like Blue Ivy's a Nepo kid to some extent. I think that's dope. Like that she has a Grammy, that she it has successful parents and like they're definitely helping her to have like a very successful career in the industry. However, with Beyonce getting her daughter or any child of hers involved in Disney I just feel like nothing good can come from this. Like Disney operates in a certain way. And I definitely feel like, you know, nothing comes for free. And the Carters did have their name on that Epstein list. And, you know, again, where is Sir Carter? Where is Solange's supposed alleged grandbaby, Strange? Holly was involved with Disney and look at her now. And now Blue Ivy is getting involved in Disney and it started with Beyonce. I feel like the Carters clearly are working with Disney. You know, they have some type of business over there that is like allowing them to, you know, get into the film industry. I know Beyonce has wanted an Oscar for a while. She's doing whatever she can, I believe, for this Oscar. You know, she did the song for that movie, King Richard, and again, voice Nala. So she's been in several films. So she's definitely like, you know, she said out of her own mouth she wants the Oscar. She likes being in the film industry, and she's definitely pushing her kid to be in it. And just again, knowing what I know about Disney, I'm just like, hmm. You know, very interesting how Blue Ivy is working with them. And, you know, I just, again, I just think about these kids because I know what happens in the industry and how the industry treats children. And so I just side-eye it when parents, especially parents who have lived through the industry, give their kids over. But it just continues to vindicate what I've been saying, which is part of the deal in having some of these things is handing your kids over, you know, like they're the collateral in the contract. I think Blue Ivy will do okay. Um, I think maybe part of why they're giving her, and I don't mean to be shady, Maybe part of why they're giving her like voice roles is because, you know, maybe like they don't think she's appealing enough for visual roles. Um, you know, but a lot of Beyonce fans try to make it seem like Blue, uh, Blue Ivy looks like her mother, which she does not. And... That just that's just a fact. She does not she does not favor her mother. Um, I think when Rumi gets older, they might try to like. I think she looks a little bit more like Beyonce. They might have her more, more so in the camera. But as far as Blue Ivy, I'm like, hmm. You know, you've done a lot of voice projects, and that's just something that I've noticed. Um, I wonder will they try to put her in this in the music game or keep her in acting? I just want to see how far this goes because right now Beyonce is 
pulling Blue Ivy all over the place. She's got her dancing. She's got her on records. She's got her doing a film. So definitely think they're maybe trying to turn her into a well-rounded entertainer. But let's just see how far this goes. Are you guys going to watch the movie? I did not watch the one that Beyonce was in. I don't think Beyonce is a great actress. I think even as a voice actress, I can't take her serious. Um, I'd be more interested in hearing Blue Ivy than her. That's the gag. I think Blue Ivy can do a better job of voice acting than her mother. So I, I would go see it for Blue. I would. I'm not going to even lie. But I'm just like, child, like, Laura, protect this child. Like, seriously, from this damn industry. And um, I just want to see, you know, I'm here. I'm here to see how, like, far her career goes and, like, what they decide to do. But other than that, you guys, let's talk in the comments. Bye.